All right, time to take a look at the forecast with 4029 meteorologist Robert Sir joining me on this sunny Saturday. That this is, is going to be the nicest day probably of the next few, at yeah. least until maybe next weekend. Yeah, today and tomorrow for the most part. But yeah. real quick, we'll hit you with a little trivia here. Oh, you got trivia. July 15th, 1988. Let's see if you get this. The greatest Christmas movie of all time was released in theaters. Can you get it? 1988? 1988. A Christmas story? No. Uh, oh, Die Hard? That's right. <laughs> he got it there. For That is the best it Christmas, is a Christmas movie, movie of all time. Yes, so uh, I wish I was doing the forecast for Nakatomi Plaza, but uh, not today. <laughs> we have uh, some hot weather on the way in northwest Arkansas over the next couple of days. You can see, yeah, back to near 100 degrees, folks, as we get toward Tuesday, Wednesday. The humidity will come up as well. It will be tough sleeping weather with temperatures only falling into the mid to upper 70s. River Valley, pretty much the same thing uh, above the century mark. For Tuesday and Wednesday, heat indices probably 110, 115, maybe worse than that. All of this rain, there's a lot of soil moisture, and that just makes the humidity feel all the more worse, unfortunately. Have some th thunderstorms approaching southeast Arkansas along this cold front. They've got, today is their severe weather day. Ours was yesterday. Things are nice and quiet for us. We had some cloud cover across uh, LaFleur and Scott County earlier with a decaying thunderstorm complex, but. As you can see for Northwest Arkansas, nothing but sapphire blue skies on this Saturday evening. Nothing to worry about. Uh, gorgeous Saturday night uh, in Eureka Springs up in the mountains of Carroll County. Temperatures across Northwest Arkansas. A lot of double snowmans, a lot of 88s across Northwest Arkansas with some lower 90s as well. River Valley, about the same thing. A couple of high wispy cirrus clouds and temperatures upper 80s and lower 90s. Really nothing to worry about or be uh, really not too bad. It is a little bit more humid in the River Valley, but I think most people take those temperatures over what we had and what's coming especially. We'll be nice and quiet tonight. We will have a thunderstorm complex sliding through southern Oklahoma tomorrow that could scrape LaFleur and Scott County with a couple of showers. Maybe we're not expecting severe weather or anything like that. We might see a little bit of an increase in a high cloud cover tomorrow uh, and then we'll be quiet for most of Sunday. Most of us should be dry Sunday night into Monday. Another thunderstorm complex could slide through, but that could scrape us to the west. Again, just a slight chance for showers in northwest Arkansas and the River Valley into Monday morning. 60s and 70s tonight, really not too bad. These are numbers where we should be for this time of the year. And then a little bit warmer tomorrow by a handful of degrees, but not too much. It's once we get into the middle part of the week, that's when it gets hot. And those hot temperatures will also create quite windy conditions. Uh, so we might have to worry about uh, wildfire danger as well, especially where it has been drier. But you can see by next weekend, temperatures start to slide the other direction. This has been that theme. Cool weekends, hot weekdays. We'll continue this as we get into next week. River Valley up above 100 degrees. Stay with us. Cameron's back. She's got some hot baseball news coming up after these messages.